Hi family, welcome to the Car Pathway of Cooking. Before we get started on this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss a single video. Hey everybody, welcome to the Car Pathway of Cooking. My name is Alicia, and as you can tell, I am not standing in my kitchen. Today we are on location. We are in my parents' kitchen. I have a special guest today. My mother, she's gonna cook her delicious, amazing lemon pound cake. Y'all, get you a pad, a pencil, and write this down. I'm gonna put the ingredients in the description box, but you don't wanna miss this one. <clears throat> Mom. Do you want to say hi to the family? Hello, everybody. This is my beautiful mother. Y'all can call her mom if you want to. That's what everybody do, call her mom. But anyway, let's get to the ingredients so mama can make this cake, because she's already been pressuring me for time. You better hurry up. So let's get to it. Okay, family. All right. Here's the ingredients that you would need for this fabulous, delicious, lemon pound cake. First, what you're going to need is three cups of sugar. Mm -hmm. And you're also going to need two sticks of real butter. Unsalted. Unsalted. Don't get margarine, get real butter. Okay? And you're also going to need six jumbo eggs. I know you see 12 here, but my mom is making two cakes. One for the video and another cake for something else. But you're only going to use six jumbo mm -hmm. eggs. I have my cheat sheet here, y'all. This is mom's recipe, not mine. And you're going to use three cups of all-purpose flour. And you're going to need one, listen to this now, a half a teaspoon of salt, a half a teaspoon of baking powder, and a half a teaspoon of baking soda. What mama did, she added it into the flour and she sifted it. Sifted the flour and put it back in this container. So um, you have your flour with your salt, baking powder, and baking soda already combined. So this is ready. This is ready. And you're going to need one cup of buttermilk. buttermilk. Please do not get the non-fat buttermilk unless that's what you prefer. But if you want to make this cake like mama cake, you want to get whole buttermilk. And that would be one cup. And you're also going to need, as far as your flavoring, some uh, teaspoon of vanilla flavoring and you need a teaspoon of your lemon per flavoring. Okay? This is going to take care of the cake portion. Now, let's get down to that delicious icing that she's going to put on the cake once it's done. What you're going to need for your icing, your lemon icing, you need two cups of confectioner sugar confection sugar, I'm sorry. Two tablespoons of melted butter, and you can put your butter in the microwave when that time comes, okay? <clears throat> just to melt the butter. You're not gonna cook it, you just mm -hmm. wanna melt it. And you're also gonna um, use some lemon juice. You can use the um, store-bought lemon juice, or you can get fresh lemons and squeeze them yourself. It's gonna do the same thing, same thing. and. We're gonna talk to you as far as how to make the icing when we get to that part. And something else you're going to need, get you a really deep baking pan. What you call this pan? Bunt pan. Bunt pan for your cake. If, use what you have. If you don't have a deep one, don't go out and buy one. Use what you have. And to flour your baking pan, you're gonna need some bacon nonstick cooking spray. A lot of people use Baker's Joy. 
this is what we use. This is just as good. It's an off-brand, and if you live in um, in the area or if you live near a Food Depot, you can purchase this from Food Depot. Maybe Walmart or Kroger's, I'm not sure, or Czech Publix, but this is an off-brand, and it's a really good brand, and it costs less than the Baker's Joy. I'm not knocking the Baker's Joy because that's good, but this is just as good, and this is not sponsored. I'm not sponsoring this, I'm just letting you know. This is just as good as the Baker's Joy. Your case will come out perfect. All right, did I cover everything, Mama? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, well, we're gonna get everything ready so Mom can come over and show you how to make this cake, and she's gonna do what she do. We'll be right back. Well, she's using, she's pouring the flour in, y'all. If you hear noise in the background, that's the fan inside of the oven. I'm sorry, y'all. You can tell I don't bake cakes, okay? That was sugar that she put in there. That was not flour. That's why I'm over here on location. So you can see how cake is made the right way. As you know, I'm not a baker. I'm learning as you are learning. Now she's adding her butter and this is room temperature butter. Let me take my mask off y'all so you can hear me. Let your butter sit out at, how long did you let it sit out, about two days? You know, it would be good for me to plug up this. Plug up the arm. Yeah, I need it ready. Mama, make sure to turn down, because you don't want sugar going everywhere. There we go. Okay. She's combining the sugar and the butter together. And she's gonna add one egg at a time. And what she does, she cracks each egg individually in a bowl to make sure it's a good egg. the bottom of it. Make sure I get the sugar so you go the crystals. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Make sure you um turn your mixer off and stir the bottom of your bowl to make sure you don't feel the granules from the sugar. the ingredients. We'll be right back. All right, we 
your back family and mama show them the texture that you want your mix cake mix to be you want it fluffy this is the texture next she's gonna add um her flour you know, I don't do no way. I just pull it. Yes, you don't have to divide the flour up. Just pour it in there. And the first um, mixture that she did, she let it run for 10 minutes to get it fluffy. That was the sugar and the butter. It went for 10 minutes to get it fluffy. She's now adding her buttermilk. And she's gonna add vanilla flavoring. And you wanna preheat your oven to 320 degrees Fahrenheit. And you're gonna let your, your cake cook for one hour. You're gonna let it bake for one hour, family. When you get to that part. I'm kinda of jumping ahead of the game. That's a certain amount of the uh... Flavor. flavor that you put in it? Mm-hmm. and lemon. Oh, okay. So like a teaspoon, a tablespoon? Or? A teaspoon. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Alright, y'all. So you're gonna let this mix for? It's probably about six or seven minutes. Six or seven minutes. Do so you have to stop it here and there to straight down the sides? I am wanting a little bit more flour. Okay. Yeah. We'll be right back, family. All right, we're back. She's gonna scrape down the sides to make sure everything is combined properly. Mama ain't gonna stir you wrong, family. She's not gonna stir you wrong. All right, we'll be right back. your cake mix family this is what it should look like and it I think it mixed for about six or seven minutes and what mama gonna do next is show you how to spray your pan most of you already know how but some of you don't so this is for you Lemon 
pound cake and we're gonna she's gonna make the icing the lemon icing and put it on the cake and we will be right back family all right family we are back look at this beautiful lemon pound cake we want you to see it before she flip it over onto the little plate there but this is what it should look like. That is golden delicious, so y'all. So we're gonna be doing what I So, I ain't scared. She <laughs> said she ain't scared. <laughs> <laughs> y'all all close? Hope it come out right. Take it out. <sighs> all right. Oh, all right. It is still hot. Mm. Yeah, mm -hmm. Ooh, that's pretty. Smell good too. Oh boy. Mm. Mm. Yep, me and my father-in-law are gonna test that tonight. Right, James? Yeah, we are. <laughs> hmm. You need to turn that Uh-uh. Okay. You wanna leave it like that? It's up to you, mama. Oh, okay. Yeah, see, look, I guess it'll go in there. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Now I gotta make the icing. All right, family, we getting ready to make icing now. Let mama do what she do. She's gonna make the lemon, lemon icing. Sugar. Yep. And at this at this time, family, you can go ahead on and melt your butter. Melt it in the microwave. Don't cook it. You just want to melt it. She's adding the lemon juice. Would you start with about a tablespoon? I'm okay. gonna just add a little at a time because put too much there to add more sugar. Just add a little bit at a time. Anyway, so I guess I do three. Okay. So this is gonna be three cups of confection sugar instead of two. You kind of like eyeballing it, so to speak. I'm gonna give a shout out to Donna. I don't know if she watched my videos or not. I think it's called Beautiful Creations with Donna. Donna, my mother, loves your channel. She really loves your channel. So do I. 
each time you make a cake, she called me. <laughs> and she said, child, Donna made another cake. I think I think she unofficially adopted you, Donna. If you're watching, ever watching this channel, my channel, the Cart Path Way of Cooking. But my mother and I love your channel, and I'm gonna make some of your cakes the way you made them. Did you hear that, Donna? All right. My mom is one of the local bakers in our town here. That's why I come to Mama and let Mama bake. And since I moved closer to home, whenever I want something sweet, I come to Mama. Two cents out of it. <laughs> Ooh, this is, this is a bit of rhyme before me. Oh, it looks good. Mm -hmm. Can we cut it now, Mom? We have to wait. Oh, it can be cut. Jack, you gonna taste it? <laughs> All right, family. <laughs> this is the end result. Mama is cutting, slicing the cake. Don't make them too big. Jacob and my pops, they're gonna taste it. Oh, look at there. Oh, man. Now, yeah. That's a Morse cake. This is what your cake should look like. Homemade lemon pound cake. Okay. Now that's light and fluffy. This is 
what your cake should look like. Um, I'm gonna have to take over the camera right quick, so y'all give me a minute. Be right back. Okay, we're getting ready to test out this lemon pound cake family. Me and my father-in-law. Ready to go for it, James? Might as well. All right. <laughs> Talking about Morris. Mm, mm, mm. Somebody oh. called the law. Ooh. <laughs> or the crime or something like that. <laughs> Show them, Morris. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. This is the best pound cake ever, mother in law. This is good. This is good. You don't even need the milk. You don't. Mm, Show them, Morris. Oh, this is good. Mm. Wow. All right, family. It's just moist. You got it. I'll try it. If you haven't already done so, family, go ahead, subscribe, and everybody hit that like button, notification bell. Y'all got to try this cake. Got to. Got to. Got to try it. Mm, mm, mm. It smell good up in this kitchen. Wow. James, you going at it. This is my pops, y'all. <laughs> Look at Jacob. Look at the cameraman. It's good. It is good. All right, y'all. We're going to end this video. And as I always say, I always remember to stay humble and kind. And nothing like a pound cake. Yep. You got that right. Mm. All right, y'all. This is it. And we're going to close this video out. Y'all slow down now. <laughs> Pops and Jake. <laughs> Y'all want another slice? Oh, good. Just good. Yes, it is. I want to show this um, cake again, a close up of the cake with it sliced. Y'all see that? Look at the icing on the inside of that cake. Mm, mm, mm. Y'all give it a try. And we're going to catch you on the next video. Much love to everyone and thank you for supporting us. And we'll see you next time. Take care.